I wanted to, for us to take a stand. We really need to, you know, save the trees. This is a golf course. Tuesday night, Common Council members rejected a resolution from Councilwoman Anna Duleep that she says would have been a first step in permanently preserving woodland behind the golf course at Oak Hills Park. That we are calling on others to take the appropriate <clears throat> steps. The resolution would have been non-binding, saying the council would encourage the Oak Hills Park Authority and the Conservation Commission to eventually ensure 7 to 10 acres of land at Oak Hills be declared protected open space. The vote failed 10 to 5, with the Democratic Caucus the only members voting yes. There should be uh, dual use. The no voters gave various reasons for rejecting the proposal. What I would uh, hesitate doing is allowing people to go onto the a golf course and uh, thinking that it's an open space park where they can uh, freely walk throughout the premises. Anybody goes there and walks, is that the danger of getting hit with a golf ball? I think it's important that anything like this have the proper discussion at the committee level, or whatever form it's in, not a full council meeting. Um, with no prior collaboration with anybody else to see if anybody else's interest. The land in question was a possible building site for a driving range at Oak Hills. The Park Authority opted to build at a different location in August. Mike Peel, it's relevant.com.